meditation walks here in Zeeland. So let's have a look particularly here at this beautiful walk starting off in the village of Ritten, having a short walk around a bit of a woodland or a wetland area, coming up here at this uh, beautiful sea dike, embracing the whole Westerschelde at this beach and then go further around Fort Romekens, uh, which is around 15 kilometers walking, three and a half hours walking, combined with a guided meditation. So why walking meditation? So first of all, you actually kill three birds or two birds with one stone. Number one is walking in nature itself. According to Japanese science, spending at least 30 minutes a week in nature has incredible amount of health benefits. They call it Shinru Yuku or forest bathing. So we have of course a little bit of both forest, beach, sea and it can really help us to first of all relax and it gives us an invite to reflect on life itself. Perhaps our studies, business, career, relationship and basically what we do is we take a step back and then we can step up in self-awareness, consciousness and we can start to look at our life from a helicopter view. We can bring our vision, vision back into alignment in order to move forward in what it is that we have to do on a day-to-day -day basis. So we get the elements of walking itself and then meditation, which is of course a very beautiful, relaxing way to recharge, rejuvenate, reset the whole nervous system, ground our energy, especially when we are dealing with a lot of stress or anxieties or elements of perhaps burnout or depression. This is a beautiful way to first of all prevent any of these title type of challenges because when we face these type of challenges it is already a little bit like hey you know life is giving us a warning sign that we need to take a couple of steps back in order to rebalance ourselves. So this will be probably a little bit more for those dealing with hyperactivity and hyperactive minds, think about ADD or ADHD who have tried meditation but struggle to sit still on a cushion, indoor lungs for a couple of hours, trying to find peace within themselves. I found walking in nature already a meditation on its own. So it's not really about, you know, trying to actually meditate, it's actually getting out in nature, walking, exercise, it's already a form of relaxation. Then it's also really very relevant for those dealing with, let's say, a restless or a highly sensitive soul or nervous system who really need some more time for themselves to, to reset, recharge, rejuvenate. And uh, the best way for them is getting out in nature, but they don't really do it for themselves because, you know, they think they are too busy for that and they would rather join a walking group in order to, to reap the rewards and the benefits from that. Another very beautiful element is, of course, the social aspect of it. So think about socializing, networking with those with a like-minded interest those who have an interest in mindfulness, meditation, personal development, spirituality, who are perhaps even career focused or business focused, who, who want to find themselves to create something for themselves, but are still also like kind of like a little bit stuck in daily life. And they really want to learn how to reconnect with their own passions and purpose in life in order to build and create something of their heart contents. So this is a group where we can really unite with each other, reflect on these diff different aspects, help each other, give advice, become recharged and inspired once again to go and move ahead and conquer the challenges we are facing in our daily life. So this particular route, the round rhythm for the Romacans, is something that I will be organizing on a regular basis because we got, it's a little bit of a longer walk which allows us to spend some more time together, what we have different elements of a bit of forest, a bit of beach, the sea, the Westerschelde, and of course a walk around um, for the Fort Romacans as well. And it's very easy and convenient to 
to join here when you ride a bicycle from either Vlissingen or Middelburg, which of course is very well known for a lot of jobs and careers that are there, universities, so it's very easy and convenient to reach this very beautiful nature reserve. So in case you have any further questions or you would like to learn a little bit more, I got some cards where you can learn a little bit more about uh, the benefits of forest bathing. You can also see some footage from Fort Romakens itself. There will be a link down below where I have written out a little bit more of the benefits that you can get from spending time in nature, meditation and such, and what kind of meditations, because there are different sorts of meditations. You can have a mindfulness meditation, of course, where you focus a little bit more on bringing your awareness to your breath and to the present moment. What can you sense using your five basic senses of perceiving your external reality, which can help to really to get out of the hyperactive mind and thinking and more into the body, into the present moment. But sometimes I also like to take things a little bit further, depend where the group is at. And then I like to add an element of energy healing, Reiki healing, and connect with our energy centers, but also the energy centers of the planet, of the Earth, as those have energy centers as well, which will be a next step in raising our awareness. And this is what I like to call Earth Meditations. I made another video that explains the difference between mindfulness and Earth Meditations. So in case you have any further questions, then feel free to drop a comment below. Uh, feel free to subscribe to my channel as well where i upload more videos about this topic but i've got a separate channel that focuses more on these type of earth meditations combined with energy healing reiki and that can help us to lift up our awareness consciousness connect with different elements of nature um, it actually has a little bit of elements of shamanism in it as well okay so i really hope i can meet you very very soon on one of my next events and uh, yeah let's uh, come together <laughs>